Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. In today's video, we are going to be finishing up decorating here in the living room for fall. So I guess this is technically part two of my fall living room decorating. But I decided last minute to change out the curtains. These are from Allen and Roth at Lowe's and I absolutely love these curtains. I previously had them in breakfast nook space over the French doors and I really love them there. But I thought I would bring them back out of storage and put them over here behind the couch in our living room. I really feel like they're going to cozy up this space really nicely for the fall and winter months. But my main focus for today is going to be our entryway space that we have created. We were given a piano by a family friend and I love this piano so much. I painted it a few years back and I just love the contrast and the statement that it adds in this space. So I'm really excited about decorating over the piano and I don't think I'm gonna go with a big statement piece. I think I'm gonna try and keep it on the simpler side. <laughs> you never know with me. Sometimes I change my mind last minute and you know, we're just going to go with the flow and decorate together, so I hope that I can bring you guys some inspiration or some ideas when decorating your own homes for fall. I usually have a really large sign over the piano or a wreath or um, one year I did do this mirror with some leaves kind of draped down but I think I'm just going to pull this mirror back out and put it up and leave it as is just very simple and just focus mainly on the top of the piano this year I am really trying to be intentional and not go out and buy any new things although it is so tempting and there's so many pretty new things out this year for fall but I am really trying to focus on just being creative with what I have and I definitely don't want to keep things the same each year that's just not who I am I would like to change things up move it around I want it to feel like new so with that being said I'm going to give this piano a good wipe down and then we're gonna get started decorating I went up into my attic and found this sign and I think it's going to fill in this space really nicely. I think with that big um, lantern that I have over here, I need a little bit of something to add some height and also fill in that big blank space between the mirror and the piano. So I think I'm going to use a little bit as like a backdrop for some decor. And because the piano is so dark, I wanted to bring a little bit more of those wooden tones over here. So I think that I am going to use this basket and just fill it up with some greenery and some pumpkins. So I'm just going to move some things around until I like what I see.
I picked up these stems last year and used them in a really large amber vase and I love that look but I wanted to try to downsize just a little bit so I think I'm going to try and make them work here on the piano with this little mason jar that I picked up from an antique shop quite a while ago um, and so I snipped down all of these stems and I think we're just going to arrange them and make this work here somehow. <laughs> color in this space I'm going to use this sweet little pumpkin throw that I found last year and hang this up and then I think I want to bring in one of my hydrangea wreaths that I made last year it does kind of tend to fall apart a little bit <laughs> over the years just because the leaves dry out and it can get a little bit messy so I did fill in with a couple of extra pieces but I think it still looks absolutely beautiful. I love the colors that these hydrangeas give and I really think it pulls all of these fall tones together just perfectly. had some hydrangea stems drying out and I put a little ribbon over them and I just thought it was really pretty just naturally hanging there and so I think I'm just going to add a little bit of decor to the shelf by the front door. I had some little porcelain pumpkins that I wanted to add up here that fit perfectly and I just added a fall um, framed canvas that I picked up from Hobby Lobby last year. And this will wrap up decorating here in the living room for fall. So I'm gonna finish up and then I'm gonna show you guys how the entire living room came together. you all so much for being here I hope that you enjoyed today's video and I hope that I was able to bring some inspiration to your day if you are new here thank you so much for stopping by I hope that you like what you see and you stick around and join our YouTube family we would love to have you here so be sure to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos I still have more to come for fall 
and if you will give this video a big thumbs up that lets YouTube know that you're enjoying my content and you want to see more of these videos from me but that's all for me today friends I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your weekend and I'll see you all really soon in the next one bye guys Bye.